Hello everyone, and welcome back to the AlexDB Racing Channel. Now, you might notice today, you join me in quite a different setting. Not behind the sim rig, not in the bedroom. Anyway, um, so just behind this wall right here is a uh, treat I thought I'd share with you. Um, I have just bought a new car. Can you guess what it is? This isn't giving it away, wouldn't buy one of those. <laughs> not, that I, not that I don't like them, I just can't ride a motorbike. So I'm just going to walk around now, and it is very sunny this time of day, which isn't great for lighting. Anyway, there we go, that's slightly better. I'm not entirely sure what to do with it yet, but, um, well, here it is. Da -da -da. <laughs> I know some of you may be a little bit disappointed by this, but there we go. An Alfa Romeo 147. It is the Twin Spark. Um, yeah, 2003. But here's the story. So the story is I bought this car just yesterday. Um, I literally haven't even bothered to clean it yet. I know it's terrible of me. I should have cleaned it before filming it. But what does it matter? Um, we can do a little video on cleaning it because it definitely needs a good scrub up. Um, but yeah, so the story behind it, I paid effectively scrap value for this where I work. It was traded in and to be honest, everyone just wanted to throw it on the scrap heap. But I know as a twin spark, it's uh, a fun little car. Um, I haven't driven one yet, but um i hear they're a lot of fun and you know they make for uh, fun little engines so i couldn't just let it go to scrap especially as it's only got thirty-six thousand miles on it 20 years old and it's only done thirty-six thousand miles i couldn't i couldn't let that happen i thought well worst case scenario you know i pay the scrap value for it if it's a you know if it's beyond repair then off to the scrap yard it goes but I thought I've got to at least have a go, you know. Um, you're not a true petrol head until you own an Alpha, isn't that right? <laughs> So as you can see, as much as this car really, really does need some good TLC, I reckon we can get it looking really good. I reckon there's a lot of fun to be had with this car. And I reckon, um, you know, it could turn out really well. And that's not to say this car is a complete heap. It's been obviously not driven very far, having only done 36,000 miles from factory in 20 years. But it's also got quite a lot of cool features as well. Um, one of which being it comes with cruise control and it has steering wheel uh, buttons as well. Um, it's got its, it does have an entertainment system, CD, radio player. It's got a little shelf for your business cards to go in. And next to that, just a single cup holder. But you know what? I love that. Very driver focused. <laughs> uh, sorry about the sunglet. There we go. That's sorted it out. Right. Not only that, it's also got air conditioning and dual zone climate control as well with digital displays up top there. Um, yes, it is a little bit grotty down below, but we have a five speed manual. I'm trying to get that to focus. There we go. Five speed manual gearbox and some lovely uh, actual Alfa Romeo pedals. These two, by the way, are very close together. So 
the heel toe will be a lot of fun and clutch is nice and far away it gives me proper alfa romeo vibes i like it um you know sorry just trying to get it to focus there there we go um yeah i it looks fantastic it feels fantastic sitting i know these seats aren't like the highest spec but they're actually really comfortable um they hold you really well and it even comes with, with the armrest as well so we got even more storage in there that needs to be cleaned um and that can just fold away and you've got another cup holder down there yeah it's all very nice i actually quite like it is it because it's an Alfa Romeo? I don't know. It might be. Especially with that Alfa Romeo dial right up the, dial right up the top there. And all the writings in Italian. Revs. Uh, temperature, fuel. Miles per hour. Love it. This is a nice looking steering wheel too. But yeah, just looking around the car. All looks very nice, don't you think? So, next steps for the Alpha. I think it's pretty obvious, really, don't you? Needs a clean. Needs a real good clean, this thing. <laughs> so, um, that'll be a long next. We'll watch me attempt to uh, try and detail this thing and make sure it looks nice and pretty. And then we can get to work on it. Modifications, restoration, anything you guys think I should do to the car. We'll make sure we do it, all right? No worries, I'll catch you all in the next video. Alex DB Racing, drive safe, take it easy. I'll see you all in the next one.